A program housing the homeless at the L.A. Grand Hotel is facing criticism. Some workers say the conditions there are horrible. Recently, a school housed on the property closed, saying the situation was just too dangerous for students. KCAL's Amanda Starantino reports that school leaders have now filed a lawsuit against the hotel and the city. These school hallways at the Academy of Media Arts in downtown L.A. now sit empty. A, a lot has went into this work. The building represents the curriculum. Dana Hammond moved his high school academy into this building attached to the L.A. Grand Hotel in 2022. At the time, the hotel was a site of the federally funded Project Room Key, offering shelter to unhoused people during the pandemic. Yes, Project Room Key was here. But we were told it would be leaving. That program has since expired, but the hotel's shelter space transitioned into a similar housing program for Mayor Karen Bass's Inside Safe. Hammond has now filed a lawsuit against the city and the hotel. We're told that the Inside Safe program would be leaving when our lease commenced, and unfortunately, it's been multiple extensions. By January of 2024, the Academy of Media Arts closed its doors and all his students transferred to other schools. The issue for me is to remove kids out of the danger zone of being killed because that's what the next thing was going to happen. In February of 2023, the Academy installed this fence here. Now, the city did pay half of that $25,000 bill, but a gate like this wasn't enough to keep the hotel guests out of the school. Hammond shared these images showing people he says are hotel guests that broke into the school facilities on multiple occasions over the last two years. He also says drug paraphernalia and human feces was often found right in front of the school. When they're walking past, they might do something weird or put something on the ground, I might trip on it, it might cut me or something. Like, you never know. So it did make me nervous. There was like some drug dealing outside. I think some, some of like the homeless people going down the stairs. The school has faced other challenges since moving into this new space. AMA was a charter school in the district for years. In April of 2023, Hammond's Academy received a notice of violation report from LAUSD stating in part, the charter school's current academic performance levels are not meeting the academic needs of its students. The Academy became a private school later that year and has since faced significant enrollment to Declines going from 200 students down to about 50 before they closed. So we blame that on the shelter. Mm -hmm. the, the enrollment started to dwindle because of the incidents that kept coming. The city has a lease with the LA Grand until the end of July. However, there are plans to begin to move residents of the Inside Safe program to another hotel starting in May. I know that we're going to be successful because it's about people and it's about service. Hammond still has a lease on the property and hopes to reopen his academy as soon as possible. In downtown LA, Amanda Starantino, KCAL News. And we have more on this story. A representative from the LA Grand Hotel declined to comment on the lawsuit. Meantime, Mayor Karen Bass's office released this statement saying in part, the city took steps to help address the school's requests and will continue to support Los Angeles's young people while bringing people inside to save lives. Mm.